What are some of the best practices that you've seen in your own clients that you'd recommend to others looking to up their people analytics game? The first thing I would say is it relates back to the job itself. Get the responsibilities correct. I think a challenge that we see a lot is companies aren't actually sure what job it is that they're trying to fill. They'll use a part of our system to make sure they're aligned on typically for this type of role, these are the set of responsibilities. So when they go out to host a job, they're attracting the right type of talent and getting the right applications in. I think that then also leads into understanding for individual jobs, what does success look like? I mean, this has nothing to do with our system itself, but from the standpoint of a business leader, making sure that people are really crystal clear on goals within the role and KPIs to get there. And then overall, as it relates back to, I would say, compensation and how they're thinking about it, you know, the ability to understand and forecast what talent supply is going to look like so that, you know, how hard is it going to be to fill that role so that you can make more of an ROI calculation of, okay, if we really try to come in with an offer that's slightly below market because we're trying to save expenses, what might that do to us in terms of time to actually fill that role? So I think really in today, world, even for, you know, we end up working with a lot of nonprofits and we have that conversation around, I know that typically you, your type of organization pays below market, but you've got to figure out a way to attract that talent. You know, people are working across industries. And so really focus in on how to be successful at hiring the right people for the right role and then retaining them, obviously, along the way. 